Welcome back, folks. Mr. Blue here. We're on Mr. Blue Farms. Go Crest Valley. Uh, Farming Simulator 17 edition. Uh, well, Farming Simulator 17 Xbox One edition. Um, I got a problem, folks. Alright. Right here, top left corner, high worker, exit vehicle, chain tool selection, turn off machine, pipe out. Let me ease forward a little bit. Maybe, just maybe. Alright. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. I got scared, folks. Now look at the top. Left, turn off combine and enable straw web. I guess because we was cutting canola. I got so scared there for a second. Thought we was going to trade these combines back in. But having said that, we're going to switch that. All right, worker. Please lay straw down. Yay. Now I know what was wrong with this and I was like, what the heck, you know? Alright, we're going to enable straw, our worker. Much better, folks, much better. Now I know what I was going to use this tractor for. Uh... Totally forgot. Basically picking up my uh, trying to pick up some trees, I guess. But anyway, how y'all doing folks? That's good. I'm kinda of feeling a little better. I'm hurting in my stomach a lot. Uh, it's the next day from another episode Thursday. Which of course I'm recording at night, you know early Thursday morning um, looking for the loader wagon oh it's about a big um sheep anyway since it's way up there uh, we got to dump canola I really don't know where to dump at I really don't. Checker prices we might just sell. No, we ain't gonna sell those prices. Everything's going down. Let's go ahead and put it in this silo here. Because if it's in the other silo, folks, we have no idea unless we go over there. This in here, we can see everything from our menu, you know. Uh, let's see. I almost forgot what I was doing. Basically picking up right where we left off last time, so I went to bed early. Wasn't feeling good. The last episode. I think I've been that right there. So I just Turn the machine on, you know, saved it. Well, actually, I got mad. Seeing those combines where we couldn't enable straw with and I'm freaking out. And then I got thinking about, well, maybe because I ain't, you know, I just got through cutting canola. It wasn't registering it, so you had to cut this little wheat. <sighs> anyway. And I totally, totally a freak out moment there I was having. Now, these combines are going to get really full really fast, or they should. But I got to keep my eye on them. But we got to get that loader wagon. Oh yeah, he's almost full. She's almost full. 
Maybe we'll have time to get this guy up a little bit closer to the loader wagon. Folks, y'all watching this, don't forget, tonight, at, uh, which I should have done, done this. I think it starts at 6 o'clock, but I will be, should be, nothing else happens. I should be at the Old Silver Christmas Parade. I don't know where I'm going to be at. Just, I'll probably have a blue hoodie on or something, or my black hoodie. But, uh, was anything like it was last time? I was the only one with a camera, tripod. But they said something about it's supposed to be eighty something characters in this parade. That's pretty good size, folks. I'm trying to keep my eye on the road and keep my eye up on the top right, so I know when that combine gets full, I'm going to switch over. But, uh, folks, don't forget to watch Sanofka on, uh, tomorrow's episode, Friday. Got some news in there. I'll explain. I know I didn't. It came out. Went all the way past the sheep. Wasn't even thinking. Alright, that Nobert is a fool, so I'm gonna go get him first. I figured they would be full, but of course they hold bigger. These are some good com. Ah, oh, he's stopping now. These are pretty good combines. I was getting scared because I didn't think we was gonna be able to lay straw down. I'm like, well, at least I can use the wheat for feed. But yeah, folks, that's what it's gonna be. The wheat's gonna be for feed. Uh, we will not be selling it going to go directly towards the uh, pigs. Ooh, that won't go very far and heavy. Can't believe I've done that. Loader wagons, that's sheeps. Yeah. Oh, folks, I forgot to, to show y'all on the last episode I bought a solar panel. So we need to go check that out. Yeah, I was saying I need to come in right here. Because, uh oh. Okay, perfect timing. He's done. We gotta go over here. Load this guy. Folks, if I'm sneeze, I'm sorry. I'll try to give y'all a little warning. But if this, if this feels like I gotta sneeze any second. I don't know if I told y'all in the last episode, but I had to help my mom change the flat tire. It was like cold, really cold, folks. And uh, yeah. And I think that's why I got sick. Hmm, excuse me. No, what I'm going to do as soon as I get done with this. I got to stay away for 50 more minutes, so. I usually try not to start recording, but you know, it's been a long day. Kids are out of school. I want to show this to y'all real quick, folks. We got three, three full pallets and a quarter, and I think there will be room for two more pallets right here. So I'm gonna try that, see how that goes, and yeah, when that gets full, we're gonna start loading them on the trailer. I hate cut through Farmer John's field there. I was gonna buy this field, but I just totally forgot. But bought the solar panel instead, so I'm glad I bought that. Alright, 
one is just going to start over here on this side. I can't believe I got all that. Woohoo! Oh. Okay. Come right down left and coming down. So like I said, we want to probably won't pick all this up. I need to do across the ends first with laying out of the field area. Well, folks, uh, we got a secondary comment there. Show y'all our solar panel. Check it out. Got a little control box there, a charger box. It's the back side. Y'all should know what a solar panel is. Y'all watch my videos. This is like one of my panels here, those new ones I bought. So there's three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Mines are 100 watts apiece. That's 1200 watt system. Wow. Okay. Oh, we pull up a little bit more. Dump another trailer. He's almost. There we go. Alright, folks, it took us two full episodes and uh, partial with another one to get done the harvest. And this thing, that ain't, that ain't even half of the fields. I'll probably hold off on buying some fields. For a little bit because we need to buy some other things uh, yeah let's see here and what I was talking about going across the ends like see how this is out like right here and there that little spot there to the right. The reason for it, if the, which I don't think it's going to get full from these fields, but it might. But I just want to pick it up on the end just in case. Yeah, like that right there. I'll come back and get that. Ah, we'll get come back and get that one. Just gonna, cause we gotta fill this one up by the pigs, and then we gotta turn all the way around and drive all the way down to the south end and fill that hay off up. But I do have a plan, though. Y'all gonna think I'm silly. The cows use more, more straw than anything, probably. So I'm gonna go ahead and dump in this truck. But uh, yeah, the cows use more straw, probably, than the pigs do. I'm imagining. But we're going to try to haul it a little bit differently. We're going to put it in the hayloft. Then turn around, take the gray trailers, and pull it out of the hayloft. And transport it down to the, the bottom one. Okay, done dumping. Taking a poop, look like. Still say that looks like a face. Look at that. Look at it. Got the eyes, the nose in the middle, and there's the mouth. I don't know why this one still got the lights on for you. Oh, hey, this one's, this one's full, folks. I'm going to go on over here.
Anyway, we're not stretching for time like we was on the other one. So uh, we'll probably go ahead and pull this one out and uh, wash it up and stuff, put it to the side. Oh my god. Got to go, got to go, he's full. Can't remember if I took them over with some in them or not, but if I didn't, uh, this field here is really making good. Plus, it's a little bit bigger field, too. Though. Ah! Cat gets just like the bobcat sometimes. Swing around like that. Kind of in the hole here. But I want to uh, buy a header trailer. Because the way I go, I have to transport one of them to the market shop to pick up the head off the ground. Unless I should be empty here in a second. I'm going to drive back down this end so we can catch them. Folks, I wish the chrome wind roller would come back into the game. I really do. It's the only thing that's wide enough to get this spot here. I don't think that other wind roller is that wide. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and do something. I guess take them to the pressure washer so I'm wash them off. I guess we can use these headers for a little bit longer. I just get nerve wracking sometimes. Uh, oh yeah, they're dirty. Uh, anyway. Forgot what I was saying, folks. Yeah, we're going to uh, take the four gray trailers, pull underneath the hayloft silo, fill them up. Here, there, we might use the semi truck. It would be faster. Probably more easier to get in there, too. But we really need a header trailer for these, but I'm scared to get one. Afraid it won't hook up. It'll be like it did in Sanofka. And I don't know if this is going to fit in here or not. Uh, yeah, it'll fit. So we're going to move that front loader attachment there and park our headers in there. Yeah, he's still doing good. Uh, let's see here. See, I don't know why it's... I wish it wasn't like that. There really ain't nothing we can do. And I don't think this tractor's got enough power to handle this thing loaded. We need to check on our weeder too. see here I 
trying to think, folks, trying to think. I guess the parade tonight's one of the news I got. Uh, that should be all the Christmas parades. So, yeah. Alright, we're gonna... Try to find a weeder. Okay. Let's check our map real quick, make sure he's covered everything. Okay. Yeah, looking good. Looking real good. Okay, good. At least it's daylight. I hate weeding at nighttime. You sure can't see nothing. Alright folks, I'm going to let him make another round. Let's see, we still got a little bit missing. We need our semi. Wrong semi. Here we go. Oh, it's got weed in it. Now we're going to finish. Uh... Alright, this guy's empty. Just going to move him off the thing there. I think we're going to have a little bit extra left on wheat. But that'll be alright. Yeah, he's got his lights on. Thought I made him stop there for a second. Oh, horses for two. See, I need to do that just a little bit different, folks, because uh, keep it like that. He's on a. So he's blocked. This way we can kind of cycle around. Go ahead and get this thing started. Yeah, it just seems like he's a little under horsepower. Might be just me, but... She's almost full. Get lined up here. Oh, man. Not one of those days for this one. Skipping all over the place. Just sitting here thinking, I just wonder if this thing's going to make it up that hill going towards pigs. Right, we are full. I've got our combine check on off. That's why I went ahead and pulled the hood now because we can let him finish and I don't have to worry about both of them tying into each other and stuff. Come on, baby, make it up the hill. Come on, you can do it. Oh, yeah. It is dropping quite, quite much, but it is a big load, though. They've done it pretty good. I like to take some of these trees out right here so I have a hut view. A little bit better up there. That's way in the future, folks. I don't follow the road very good. Alright. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, man. That off the butt. Alright, we're going to unload. And, uh, yeah. Our, there it goes, folks. It's going up.
Which I don't mind if the oven gets empty or not, because as long as we got straw down here, I know we can transport it. The reason why I know we can transport it is because look over there. You see a little green trailer? And then I used the gray trailers uh, episode or two back where uh, I took one of them and used it to feed the cows some hay over the hayloft. I just wish that I put it a little bit closer to the cows. It's the only, only problem I have down there on that one. All right, he's wow. He's coming up with the last three. That's good. Oh, I don't know why it's doing that. I think it's too much straw on the ground, does it? Well, that would have worked if it was down. I split the difference and uh, made a bigger mess. All right. I don't know why it's leaving those little beady pieces. switch over to the combine. Yeah, we're going to switch over to the grain buggy. <laughs> we're going to get the combine emptied out. Yikes. Not bad. Got way too close. I think I need to trade that red trailer in on uh, another big green one. I, I like this green one. It holds quite a bit. Gets the job done. All right. We're going to go ahead and take him over here. Uh, we're just going to take them to the pressure washer. We're not going to actually wash them right now. I'm going to try to get some of this other stuff done real quick. I'm going to park them on this side. But I can That should reach. Alright, we're going to finish this. And, well, let's be bop over to the weeder. That one spot every time. I have no idea why. We're going to change directions on his travel. We're going to let uh, Jonathan run this way. That way we'll... Yeah. Chicker cows real quick. Let's check her cows. Cows are good. We just have to worry about the pigs. Get them back up there. Alright, we're going to unload this guy. If I'm not mistaken, I think we're going to have to make a, a, another trip. But, uh, whatever's left, we're going to put it in the silo up here. Whatever this truck don't hold. Alright, well that's working. Pick up a little bit more hay. Uh oh. Sorry. Straw. I'm starting that mess again, ain't I? Alright,
Not too bad you couldn't make a higher work on this. Now I'm going to go over to one side. That way I don't have double the mess like I did right there. Alright, one more field done. I hate because of that. Leaving the spots like that. Long day and night, folks. Yeah, getting kind of full. Uh. Weeder still working. So that's good. Alright, now my plan is since we got two spots the same, we'll just make a loopy little loop, whatever you want to call it, just like that. Yeah, see? I could leave it there, but we I want to get every drop possible. I really don't know how much we got. I know we're going to get a fill and a half left. All right, we full. We're going to take us up there, dump it, check on the weeder, and also check on ah, the amount left to go. Oh yeah, I forgot the grain, but grain buggy. Oh, auger wagon, whatever you go. I call them grain buggies. So if y'all hear me say that, that's what they are. Uh, that and a semi. We gotta haul it semi up here, so we can use it to haul the hay in. Ninety thousand. Let's check on our weeder. Oh yeah, still doing good. So pull up our map real quick. Oh yeah, ain't missing no spots. That's good. Oh, I forgot about eighteen. I forgot about eighteen. Can't forget about eighteen. Sure, the truck's full before I do that. Yeah, truck's full, so we're gonna go ahead and take it to the pigs. And then uh, the rest of that grain auger is gonna go to the silo layer. We got a heavy load, folks. Come on, mister, you can do it. You might not be able to do it. Oh, my goodness, folks. Now, that's a load of wheat. Alright, good. Thought we, 
Oh, by the way, there is a, uh, it's a weight, it's on your weights, I believe. You get a front and back weight, but it's made for the sullage, where you hook on to, you take one tractor, hook on to another tractor, and you can pull them up to silage, or silage. You get stuck so well uh, I think it's soybeans I dropped there let's see what our pigs need here I filled the soybeans up that's what it was now we're gonna fill the wheat up see how Mr. Robot moves out of the way I got a pallet of potatoes there. When it gets low, we can just kick them back over. Well, that didn't take much. Alright. Now, this is going to be a hard part. Actually, I'm going back all wrong. Turn around here. Huh. Uh, if I was aiming for that door, I would probably never would have hit it. I'm aiming for the second door, folks. Okay. I'll go here and open the machine for everyone. Uh, X to close door. And then we're going to go D to open this door. As you can see, the slot is empty. Uh, oink, oink yourself. Ah! Alright, that's going to take some serious talent. I have to get hung up on the fence and everything else. Come on, Mr. Blue, you know how to drive a truck. Down on the farm, you can do it here. And it's uh, not really meant for a semi to go in these tight places. Hey, we did it. All right, folks. I'm going to unload here. That front wheel trying to spin. Wow. Oh. Okay, we over overflow our batteries. Ah! Forgot to shut the back door. There you go. I'm pr pretty sure it spilled out the back there. Oh, look at there. Oh. Uh -huh. Take a look around back real quick. They may have fixed that, folks. We might have to just clean that up. But I dumped corn right here and it came out. So I thought they might not have fixed it. But yeah, I'm, I'm going to say that's full for now. We are going to take rest of the wheat and put it in a silo at the farm shop and folks is, here's where the all all the possibilities going to come out uh, start filling straw all right uh, okay
All right, before we uh, finish this field, I guess we can go ahead and finish it and go back over. Okay, I'm just going to hire a worker, let it do its thing, come back to it here in a minute. We got to get some more stuff done. All right, folks, to do this, you just got to come over here to the side, stretch your arm over, and voila. All right, while that's doing that, this guy's empty. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, front weight. See that right now. See, our semi-truck's full. Ready to go down south. I'm gonna drive this guy over to where we that last, and then check on the weeder, and then we'll come back pick up some more straw once we get the weeder going. I still missed it. Really? Alright, let's check on the weeder. What? Oh, he didn't turn around. There you go, man. Well, he turned around, but he didn't turn around. Ain't nothing but a thing. We can finish it. We got about 17 minutes left anyway. We need to look at our prices. See what we can sell. Try to get some money back in the bank. At least, you know, we ain't too far in debt. I want to keep it that way. I want to look at the map real quick. Like all we need is corn for the pigs. Let's see. Let's zoom in. Whoa. Wrong way. Alright. We got everything on that. Let's go get 18. And then, uh, what, 24 over. See, I really don't know which way the beds that work good for the combine to go this way, like that. So let's try it with this weeder. Okay. Now right, he's empty. We're going to take him over there. And we're going to watch for the weeder to say he's done while we're picking up some more straw. Yeah, I don't want to pick up no more ground right now. Not unless, you know, we, we get to plenty of it. I like to pick up uh, 11 over there by the sheep. Because I actually think that feel. Uh, get through backing up here. I got another wild hair. Uh, 
way 11's made, we could take the spot out and make it like a uh, area for a shop. Because I was going to put a shop there, but I, I don't know. It seems like 11's a little bit more central, but then again, we got a pressure washer and stuff down here, and our or a tractor customization shop or whatever you want to call it. So, I don't know. Uh, I guess we can go ahead and fix 15 up as our shop area. Because we are kind of center of the map there. So I don't know why I was thinking 11 for it, but Kind of looking at the map, it would make more sense. Hey, uh, get back down here. This end, I, I don't explain it once, but I've been way back and quite a few episodes ago but field 15 right there where our anaconda setting that over would make a good spot for a big shop for our equipment man because these here are just getting full yeah Yeah, I figured I'd be full, cool, but I guess it's going to make me go all the way to the top. Yep, there it goes. I'm probably making a boo-boo doing this. Yep, I made a boo-boo. Sorry about that, folks. I thought it was going to be a little bit smoother than that. Find out it's a little choppy. All right, let's get my speed up. There we go. Getting that speed up. Sorry about that, folks. My phone's right underneath the microphone. <sighs> Just wasn't paying attention this time around. Sitting here, I got the heater on. I'm actually sweating a little bit, but yet I'm freezing. That makes any sense? I think I got the stomach virus that's going around. Because my stomach's been messed up for several, 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 several weeks now. I will just go ahead and say a couple months. But y'all didn't even know that, right? That's TMI. Check on our weeder. Oh, couldn't time that no more perfect. All right. Must be a road right there. There it's showing that road. Okay, he's done. I ain't going to worry about folding up. Right? That didn't show up on the thing. Glad I come by there and saw that. Which that wouldn't matter that much. Alright. I, I love the speed of this tractor, but it just don't have the oh, you know what I mean? Once it's get going, the fastest tractor in the game, but Okay. All right. Let's see here. I need to move him out of the way. Let's go and wash him, but let's just do it this way. That should reach right there. 
All right, I held another load, folks. I need to fix a road right here that comes around and comes back down. Get back down here, I'll check and see how much straw we got. Got that spot. I'm on up here. Got a little over a through left, and this will be done. So we're moving right on along. And I want to go ahead and sell back the Scorpion King, folks, and take that money and buy some more animals or. Depending on how much we get back, we might buy a grain silo and get that project started. Get it started. Yeah, yeah, get it started. Oh, no. I just ain't in the mood, folks, to sing. I'm sorry. I know y'all miss my beautiful voice. Yeah, right. Wow, we got some pals out in here. Let's see if we can get these up. Well, of course, the Always gotta miss a little bit, don't I? Yeah, I don't know how much more. I guess I should look. I said it's going to look. I ain't done it yet. Get straighten up, I'll stop and look. Oh. Four hundred and five thousand folks. Hmm. Maybe uh you can fill both of them from one. I don't know. Didn't work that way last time. When I was down shot. Hmm. South, 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 oh. I was down south and was filling that one up down there and it, got, it quit on me. So I brought a lot of up here to the pigs. So I, I just don't know, folks. I'm not going to... Get these just in case we're probably end up holding all of this. All right, ain't been too bad this little tractor. It's got some irons on it. Uh, don't know if I let it go back or not. Probably go to 40 hours at least. What I probably do is get like three or four tractors of the same kind. What do you do? The tractors swap out. Might not be all at once, but yeah, we'll get one or two, swap them out, and go from there. Now the question is, is our weeder still going? Yeah, he's almost done though. And we'll move him to 19 and 16 and then he'll be right on our booty. We'll probably be done by then though, hopefully. Speaking of done, we got about five minutes left, so yeah folks. Uh oh. 
we're full on this end, so I'm going to go right on up here. I know, here I go climbing mountains with a loaded load, right? But this way here would make another good road. Clear some of these trees out. See all this smooth? Right back up to the pigs here. That's for a side job in the future or something. Alright, let's check on our weeder. I gotta quit doing that, folks. That's perfect time. Once again, I want to check him. Make sure he gets skipped out. Okay. Well, since he's on this end, let's go on up to this rail here. Watch out, car. Watch out, sign. Ooh. Oh, I still got it. I done a karate chop on it. All right. All right, empty out again, so that's good. Folks, I know y'all was wanting to see that hayloft get full, but we are out of time and out of money. Well, not really out of money, but yeah, kind of, sort of. Uh, yeah, okay, go down here and finish this up. One, two... Two rounds and a through. I know, right in y'all's ear, right? Y'all probably like, no wonder you can't sleep all that phone. Usually when I go to sleep, I won't hear none of that. Not till whenever I wake up. But folks, we are, well, we got about two minutes left. So, uh, yeah. I'll go just a little bit longer. Not bad. Two rounds left. That's a pretty good sized place, but it just needs another shop. I think it needs a big shop instead of one of those lean to bills. Alright, we got the uh, do this here, which works out pretty good. All I gotta do is we'll make a circle, pick it up. Yeah. Just like that, folks. Alright, we might be full when we reach to the end. We'll have a round left. We'll get back up to the hayloft, we'll check and see how full it'll be this time around. Check on a weed or two before we go, I guess. Oh, I knew it would do something like that. Come 
Come on, Putt Putt. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Alright, folks, uh, that'll be a minute, but I'm going to go ahead and get some of the singing out of the way. You know, all junk I got to say two or three times. Um, uh, y'all hit that like button for me, okay? Really helps me out a lot. Y'all know that. Share me with your friends. Uh, subscribe. And if you have subscribed already, make sure you got the post notifications on. That's right down there beside the subscribe button. When you hit it, it makes a little bell look like it's ringing. And, uh, yeah, that helps me out a lot, too. Oh, folks, it's going to be close. Oh. No more compact. Oh. Alright, no more capacity. We're going to take a little trip down south. And, uh, yeah, I should have kept going like I was going. That would have been a whole lot better way, wouldn't it? But anyway, we're going to run this down south to the other hayloft and see if we can put any in there. Things supposed to hold 250,000 liters, and we're not at 500,000, so. Yeah, something's wrong somewhere. Oh. I know my driving ain't good, folks. I'm sorry. But anyway. But yeah, uh, like I was saying, hit that like button, share me, subscribe. All that good stuff, folks, helps me out a lot. Uh, I ain't received no comments or anything about the clothing material. Uh, Ask y'all to leave some comments down below about if y'all would want to buy some shirts and stuff from me. Uh, Mr. Blue Farms. Be like a little four inch logo on the front and then probably a good big logo on the back. Uh, of course, I ain't got no prices either, so I guess we're both to blame, huh? Oh man, I came in the wrong. Put that on the back side. But anyway, I'll see if I can try to talk to the guy and get some prices on some shirts and hoodies for y'all. I have that in the comments. Or in the description. But uh might be after Alright, this one did hold some. Alright folks, five hundred thousand and strong. And we're maxed out. So yeah. Let's go down here to the house. See if we can top him off. Get everything filled up. Oh, a lot. Oh, my God. It didn't hold up. What am I going to do with all this straw left, folks? Uh. Those salvage bills are out of there. I'll tell you what. Oh, fifty thousand off a lot of straw. We're just gonna have to make us a pile right here, folks. But anyway, once again, go hit the like button, share, subscribe, post notifications. Thank you for watching. Uh, tune in until next time. There we go. Tune in to next time. Well, uh, 
Gotta figure out how to put all the straw in. Folks, we got us another square that won't fill up. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, folks. Yeah. Tune in next time. Oh my god. Alright, folks, I'm going to end it right there. Yeah. It happens here at Mason Blue Farms. More than usual, folks. Y'all have a blessed day. Good night. Good day. Whatever. Wherever y'all are at. Thank you for watching. And. Bye.